Hey guys, I'm back. Sorry I missed a week. I uh, got really sick and like couldn't even move or hardly anything. I was so sick. Um, I did get a chance to work on a new intro, so I'm going to roll that real quick. Hope you guys enjoy it. On today's episode, we're back with the Dremel Idea Builder. Um, I've got this weird thing where a bunch of the words in the menu screen aren't showing up. Um, and like um, when it warms up and says warm or hot up in the top corner of the screen, it's not actually saying anything, it's a bar. Um, so I contacted Dremel and they gave me a couple things to try out and I figured I'll do a video on it so that if you guys are having the same problem, you can try these things out as well. So what Dremel is thinking is either the card, which is basically the hard drive, um, ha is uh, loose or has some sort of corrupted uh, file or contaminated file on it. Um, so the first thing I'm going to check is make sure that the card is actually still connected correctly. So to do that, you basically just flip it on its top, make sure to unplug it first from power, and remove the screws from the bottom. Alright, so all the screws are out. You want to be careful because there is a wire attached to the bottom plate right here it's the grounding wire we got the back off again you want to be careful of your grounding wire um, which is just connected to the bottom piece so you don't want to pull it down really fast if you look right here there's a mini SD card um, that's held in by a little bit of super glue or uh, hot glue you want to very carefully pop that out clean the super glue off just kind of check out the card make sure everything's good it looks fine go ahead and slide it back in and it'll click like that and then I'm going to go ahead and put the back or the, the bottom back on and we'll test it out and see how it works or see if that even fix the problem. All right, so I've got the bottom back on. I flipped it back up and I plugged in the power. Let's see what happens. So if you remember what the problem was, some of the words weren't showing up. Some of them still were showing up fine, but some of them were not. So I'm going to um, check out our main page still has a lot of the words missing. We go into tools and all the words are missing so now we're gonna have to go into the next step which is we got to pull the card back out again all right so we've got it in our computer now and it is removable I so what we want to do is go into right click and then click on format all this should be correct just make sure that that's the capacity on the card. It's an actual four gig card, but they're card, but they're never quite um, that full. So you do quick format and start warning. Format will erase everything. Do we want to do this? Yes, because we believe that we have a bad uh, file on our um, card. All right, so formatting is complete. So as part of that email they sent me, they actually sent me the new files. Um, and here they are. So what you want to do is you want to select on both of them, just hit shift and click on the top one and then the bottom one. Drag them into the new, or the card. 
and it'll move it over and we'll put it back in the printer and see if that fixes our problem. All right, keep your fingers crossed that this works. Got the card back in, screwed the bottom back on, all that good stuff. Hey, look, words. See, before all of these were gone, and you go into settings, and this would just be a blank page of blue boxes, like the back arrow was gone, um, and everything. I hope that was helpful to some of you. Um, again, the way I got the file was I just uh, emailed the Dremel tech support from their website, just uh, Dremel 3D printers um, website said, hey, this is the problem I'm having. They said, hey, it's probably this. We'll send you all the information on it. Um, they actually sent like an Excel file and a Word document with um, the Excel file. I had pictures on step by step on how to take it apart, which I already knew, but it had pictures of like where the SD card holder was and everything to try for this particular problem. Um, so hopefully this video was helpful. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up. I hope you guys liked the new intro. Um, if you haven't already, please subscribe. Um, got some more Dremel stuff coming. Got some new stuff coming for the Robo as well. Um, so I'll see you guys in those ones. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.